Greetings. It is I, Omanike. Today is April 26th on a Monday at approximately 1930. <clears throat> this is going to be a quick video. I started cleaning out the Serenity Garden. Now, if you look at my videos from last year, I bought some as they call it society garlic and it was a big clump what i've done was i cleared out a lot of these which are the wandering jews it was all in a bag you know it grows very quickly so i cleaned it out society garlic is that's what it is it's garlic and it has beautiful purple flowers on it well i separated at the bulb and I spread it out. So I did that side and this side. So there's one clump here and I separated it and this is what I've done. So I got a lot of the Wondering Jew out. I have to come in here and dig out Wondering Jew like every two to three weeks that's what i should be doing but i do it maybe i don't know once a month this is mexican petunia it has beautiful purple flowers and uh, let me tell you this thing loves water once you put it in the ground though it's going to spread just like wandering jew and i don't want that because it'll be all over when I first moved here, um, about 10 years ago, I planted the Mexican petunias and I had to pull them all out because I wanted something different. So this is what's going on. Now I would love to spend some more time. Oh yeah, I just wanna show you this over here. At this end, I left it wild because I love the look of it cascading on the uh, walkway. So I just left that over here. Now, I would love to, oh gosh, and it smells like garlic too. I would love to um, spend more time and plant some more things, but the reality is. Things are coming up, which I don't want to talk about right now, but it won't make any sense for me to do anything different at this time. So what I'm doing now is just simply maintaining. Now, I have this fern, which I cut down. The fern used to be up here on the other side of Ogun. Um, I cut it down and I'm just simply watering it and it's, it's coming back. So, yeah. And as far as this mulch, I'm going to need another, uh, layer of the, uh, the mulch. The mulch I use is the nuggets and it's so pretty when it rains. It's a beautiful, it turns a beautiful brown color. So I spent a lot of time the other day just pulling out the weeds and all that stuff and, and it, it does grow back Let's see over here that's not too bad and over here i already see some stuff growing back over here I have someone taking care of the grass because I do not cut grass. So, yeah. So, just letting y'all know I'm still around. I'm doing my thing. I've already taken my shower. 
So I just wanted to come out before um, before it gets dark. And you see the crepe myrtles are growing in nicely. And soon they'll start blooming. So what I'm doing, I'm basically just, just trying to trim the bottoms. Yeah. And this is a hibiscus. And the type of hibiscus this is, it droops. It's like, I think it's a pink or a red one. Yeah. And I had a hibiscus. You can see it. Over here. See that pink one? But I've been keeping this alone. That's what I'm going to do. I just want the crepe myrtle to do its thing. And I don't know what the heck this is. But... The butterflies love it. All right. See, I'm nice and fresh, taking a shower. So, just wanted to show a quick video and show my face. I know I said I was going to um, post a bunch of videos during my time off, but I haven't. I haven't done that. Guess what I've been doing? working weekends and they want me during the week too and I've been doing it. <sighs> All right, shoes off. <laughs> All right, be well.